Hello YouTube, in this video I will present you a very tiny board, this one here, you can't even see it, it's that tiny, but this is what I used to make this electronic, uh, not electronic, gadget tray, gadget Christmas tree I will call it, and uh, you do hear some uh, jingle bells in the background. This is actually my already track. Uh, let me turn it off. Already track that I designed, and then it got followed by this version with the color display, neo pixels, and whatnot all around. But anyway, I always wanted to have a way to plug in my gadgets and have them uh, to, or to be able to display them. And. Um, most of them have uh, now type C connectors on the bottom so and since I have way too many gadgets to put on a straight line I and I had this base here that I used before I don't even know for what but uh, I built before and um, uh, well it ended up going to the top I can show you how far it goes up and it kind of looks like a Christmas tree if I take my lighting back sorry for the shaky camera movement I'm doing it on my tripod so this is what I made it's not quite finished yet as I designed this board which I call banks here uh, let me actually get to the regular magnification I did call it type C power pad by of course me and uh, it's a small 18 by 40 millimeter PCB and you see the slot here and this is the back side and I did order some connectors I used them all up I didn't even have enough to, enough of them I only had ordered 10 the USB type C connector goes in through here or actually comes from the top and then gets soldered to the bottom pieces here uh, I really have to get the lightning so this is the back of it upside down if you want to see the date and uh, this is the front of it of course you could there are similar boards out there that you can buy but I wanted to drop it on the floor so I wanted to design my own and get it to focus and include the on off switch and uh, well I didn't want to put neo pixels on this one because otherwise I would have to put a, a microcontroller chip on there so I just used uh, blue and uh, red LEDs blue and red or blue and green no red and blue <laughs> um, so depending on if it's turned off and on or off you can uh, oh, it will show you on the PCB as you can see here for example it's blue and I can turn it off then it's red well it's still running because it runs on a battery but you can turn it on and off so this is what I designed and I designed it for type C and since some of my gadgets uh, do have micro since they're a little bit older have micro USB uh, I just plugged in a short cable there and um, connected them like that otherwise all the others are connected via type C and some of my uh, items have the connector on the top so since this is a 2020 aluminum profile I put it on the bottom of the profile and could hang those in there technically so you can just 
unplug them or plug them back in and if they're connected from the bottom it's like that or they can be connected from the side like this matrix clock for example then it's on the side and the beauty of uh, type c is of course you can plug it in either way so i can have that on the right side with the switch facing to the front or have it on the left side facing the switch again to the front and plug in my gadgets like that uh, this is my canvas uh, gauge and since this has the wire uh, the connector on the back oh my lighting really sucks this video so since it has it on the back i just put it in there for now and i will get eventually a short cable and plug it in from the from this pad into the gauge itself and the top of the tree is not quite populated yet i have still one room here i'm holding my light in my hand i got one room here and then on the top i will add actually this i have to move the camera down again i will add my uh, two matrix clock on the top of it and i i actually wanted to put this code onto a small uh uh, small uh, heads uh, get heads oh man I'm sucking this video up um, on a small gadget of mine and put it on the top and have the Christmas tree show and the melodies uh, play but uh, I wanted to get this video out so I put it on my OLED track and uh, let me zoom out again out back so Anyway, this is my version of a Christmas tree and um, well after Christmas is over I might redo this, I might just leave it and not use it or put something else on it. Actually I wanted to make the same thing for my different can gauges that I have and uh, then I would technically just use a frame, elegant, out of uh, aluminum, just a frame, a rectangle frame and uh, have four sides that i can plug in the gadgets in there or the gauges or whatever uh, i might design another one for micro usb but uh, i'm not sure if i'm going to do it i might rather just design one with the um, uh, connector angled 90 degrees in vertical instead of horizontal so that way i could uh, mounted anywhere and oriented uh, for various different gadgets um, this pad you could technically uh, screw onto anything you like and just be able to charge your device plug it in and out and um, on the next revision i might this is just a power pad so the usb connectors are not connected and it has two connectors for plus and minus on each side so I can just uh, have one wire coming up and then connect to each other and daisy chain like that uh, I might make a USB version of it then it would uh, of course have a separate cable otherwise you would have a need to put a controller on there like a USB hub I'm not gonna do that but uh, anyway I had this idea for a long time and finally I made it. I did tell a few friends of mine, Adam for example. So this is my Christmas tree. And um, of course I had to hide all the wires. That's the whole point of it. Here is the output uh, which might change. I might make it to the out to the back. I don't know yet. But let me try to show you the back of it by turning it since my wire is rather limited I did 3, 3D print some L and T brackets uh, although there are many different designs out there I wanted to print my own 
So here you can see that you see no wires, they're all inside the channels and go inside the channel here and then out and they're all soldered together in this part here. So this is the back of it, all the way to the top. And uh, I made these individually of course, so I can just uh, adjust the height as well for positioning. And uh, whatever you want to put on there, technically you could make it bigger, you could make it to drop your can gauge. And uh, <laughs> um, what was I going to say? Uh, you could make something like this to charge your phones, although most people now have newer phones with wireless charging, whatnot. But um, my phone doesn't actually, um, it's still in one piece. Um, so, anyway. This is my version of a electronic Christmas tree. I could, I thought about to put some uh, NeoPixels into the front of it, but I didn't want to make it uh, too uh, flashy. Although this is quite flashy in itself. If I take my light away, you can see. And. Uh, how bad the image quality gets without light so anyway this is it um, if you're interested in any of the gadgets I mean this thing <laughs> looks rather ugly with the type C to micro USB extension and my OLED decade on the top of it so um, I just finished I got the PCBs on Friday and uh, it took me till the morning to finish this thing up and um, today is Saturday I think well might be Sunday by the time now so anyway this is it um, I also want to take this opportunity to thank my supporters and um, eight patreons that I still have went up to 10 at one time and then it went came down to 8 uh, anyway and um, also my Banggood supporters thank you Adam you were the only one last month and uh, I made $2.38 or something like that uh, the month before I made $28 somehow I don't know but uh, this month you were the only one so you are the one my friend <clears throat> anyway every little helps i guess uh well the make the money i make there i mean it's not gonna put any food on the table so it goes into parts and pcbs and whatnot and some ideas that come up i'm also working on my cnc lathe rather slowly um but anyway this is it. I hope you did like the video and still are here. And um, I will have a giveaway coming up in my next video. So anybody who watched it till here will know about it. Otherwise you won't. And um, thanks for all your help, your support. Uh, stay safe out there. And uh, I talk to you on the next one. Take care, everybody.